Yo, what is up, sexy beast? Crazy Rabbit here, and today I'm showing you guys a huge disappointment. And no, I do not mean my YouTube channel, I mean the Peacekeeper Mark II on round 50. So let's go ahead and get this shit started. So I'm not a huge fan of the Peacekeeper Mark II. I really loved the Peacekeeper Mark I, I guess, or I should just say the Peacekeeper, back in Black Ops 2. I used that thing all the time in multiplayer. It was a really good weapon. And since I've never played Black Ops 3 multiplayer, I can't really comment on the Mark III in multiplayer, but I can comment on it in Zombies. And I'm not a huge fan of how it looks and sounds. I think it kind of just sounds like a toy in all honesty. It has the PPSH syndrome. When they brought back the PPSH in Black Ops 3, for some reason, whenever I use it, I feel like I'm using a toy. And I get that same feeling when I'm using the Mark II. And it's really weird in Black Ops 3 because I don't feel the same way with all the weapons. I only feel that way with some of them, and it's mainly the ones that they bring back for some reason. But anyway, the Peacekeeper Mark II on high rounds is definitely a weapon you would want to avoid at all costs, unless you want to get points because this thing does carry a fuck ton of ammo. And when I mean a fuck ton, I literally mean a fuck ton. Maybe a fuck ton and a half. But this weapon has all the characteristics of an early round weapon. It carries a lot of ammo, it's got a fast fire rate, and it doesn't really do that much damage. So this is definitely an early round weapon. If you want something to whore up some points, so that way you can go spam the box or get all your perks, this weapon is probably going to be for you. Now of course you can always go get wall weapons and everything else, which kind of makes this weapon a little irrelevant. But goddamn, does this thing just carry so much ammo. But unfortunately, once you start to get up there, you would definitely have to trade this thing out. Because on round 51, it really, really really struggle just to get one kill and with all the ammo it carries you'd expect to get at least some kills but I think it really did struggle just to get like four or five kills it was just not doing anything at all and I mean hey at least it was trying we can give it a D for effort I guess we can give it the D but it's not going to get anything higher than that so that's going to be the Peacekeeper Mark II on round 51 hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'm very curious to know to all the people that play multiplayer which one do you guys prefer the regular Peacekeeper or the Mark II because I don't play multiplayer so I don't know and I'm very curious to know which one you guys think is better so if you guys could please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already peace